This is Lemfuyang Temple, one of Bali's most breathtaking and spiritually significant destinations. Also known as the Temple of the Heaven's Gate, perched high on the slopes of Mount Lemfuyang, this ancient temple complex offers much more than just spiritual importance. It provides a visual feast, with sweeping views of Bali's stunning landscapes and the towering presence of Mount Agung, the island's highest peak. Lemfuyang Temple is renowned worldwide for its iconic Heaven's Gate, a picture-perfect spot that draws travelers and photographers from across the globe. But beyond its striking beauty, the temple holds deep cultural and religious significance for the Balinese people. In this video, we'll cover everything you need to know before you go. From the temple's location and how to get there to the best time to visit, entrance fees, and our top day trip recommendations. We'll also share some handy travel tips and highlight nearby attractions to help you make the most of your visit. Let's start with the temple location. Lemfuyang Temple is located in East Bali, on the scenic slopes of Mount Lemfuyang in Karangasem Regency. It's about 80 kilometers northeast of Denpasar and approximately 70 kilometers from Ubud. The journey typically takes around two hours from Denpasar and about an hour and a half from Ubud, with routes passing through Bali's lush landscapes, rice terraces, and traditional villages. Next, let's talk about how to get there. The easiest way to reach Lemfuyang Temple is by car or scooter. Many visitors hire a driver for the day, which is convenient and allows you to relax and enjoy the scenery on the way. There are plenty of tour operators in Bali who can arrange this for you, often as part of a day trip that includes other nearby attractions. For the more adventurous, Renting a scooter is a popular option, but keep in mind that the roads can be steep and winding, especially as you get closer to the temple. Be sure you're comfortable with the drive and that you have an international driver's license. Once you arrive at the main parking area, there's a short walk to reach the temple entrance. From here, you'll find the iconic Heaven's Gate and other temple areas. If you're up for it, you can continue exploring the seven temples along the mountainside, but be ready for some steep staircases and a bit of a workout. Now, let's go over the best time to visit Lemfuyang Temple. Early morning is ideal especially around sunrise when you'll catch beautiful soft light over Mount Agung and if you're lucky, clear skies. The early hours are also much quieter, so you can enjoy a more peaceful experience and avoid the crowds that tend to arrive later in the day. Weather-wise, the dry season from April to October is perfect for a visit. The skies are clearer and you're less likely to encounter rain. Keep in mind, though, that this is also peak tourist season, so if you want to skip the biggest crowds, aim for weekdays instead of weekends. Finally, late afternoons can also be a good choice, as the lighting is softer and there's a chance the crowds may have thinned out a bit. Just make sure you give yourself enough time before sunset, as the mountain roads can be tricky to navigate after dark. Let's go over the entrance fees. To enter Limpyong Temple, there's a donation-based entrance fee of 150,000 Indonesian rupiahs, approximately 10 United States dollars per person. This fee includes the shuttle service from the parking area up to the main temple gate, which is a convenient option if you'd prefer to skip the steep walk.
Next, let's talk about the best day trips to combine with your visit to Lemfuyong Temple. You can explore the beautiful Thirtaganga Water Palace, the serene Taman Yujing Water Palace, For your convenience, we have listed one reputable local tour operator who can help you plan the perfect itinerary, which includes entrance fees, lunch, private transportation, and a local expert English-speaking guide so you can just sit back, relax, and enjoy your day. You can find all the details and links in the description below this video. Next, let's move on to some helpful travel tips for your visit to Lempyong Temple. First, wear comfortable shoes. The temple is located on a mountainside, and if you plan on exploring beyond the main temple, you'll encounter plenty of stairs and uneven paths. A good pair of sneakers or hiking shoes will make your visit much more enjoyable. Second, bring water and sunscreen. The sun can be strong, especially in the midday heat, so make sure to stay hydrated and protect your skin. It's always good to carry a bottle of water with you, as well as a hat or sunglasses for added comfort. Third, be respectful of the temple's sacredness. Remember to dress modestly, covering your shoulders and legs. Sarongs are required, which you can rent at the entrance if you don't have one. Lastly, be prepared for crowds, especially during peak times like the weekends and holidays. Arriving early in the morning can help you avoid the larger crowds and enjoy the peaceful atmosphere. Last but not least, let's continue with nearby attractions that you can add to your trip for a full day of exploring. First, there's Thirtaganga Water Palace, just a short drive from Lemfuyong Temple. This royal palace is famous for its stunning fountains, koi ponds, and intricately designed statues, offering a serene atmosphere and great photo opportunities. Next, don't miss Thaman Yujing Water Palace, another beautiful location nearby. With its large ponds, Balinese European architecture and panoramic views of the mountains and ocean, it's a fantastic place to stroll and take in the scenery. Lastly, if you're looking to unwind by the beach, Virgin Beach Pontai Parasi is a hidden gem not far from the temple. With clear, turquoise waters and soft sand, it's a perfect place to relax and wrap up your day. And that wraps up our quick travel guide to Lemfuyong Temple. If you have any questions or need more tips, just drop a comment below we'd love to help. As locals from Bali, we know all the hidden gems and best spots. Don't forget to follow us for more Bali travel inspiration.